at George Fox, they don't just teach you to pass the national exam, they teach you to be an excellent clinician. And that's kind of the ultimate goal for me. My name is Mason. I grew up in a Grants Pass in Southern Oregon. I had an idea of some of the different areas that you could you know, practice as as a PT, but coming to school, I've realized that there's so much more. I kind of already knew that I wanted to work with like the neurologic population. And now I'm getting some experience with kind of inpatient neuro, and I feel like neuro is where the Lord is calling me to practice. I feel like that's where my blessings and my strengths would best serve the population. But if I'm being honest, inpatient neuro kind of scares me, and I feel like sometimes that's kind of where I'm being called to practice at. Sometimes it is the scary decision, and you just have to trust the Lord and His plan for you, and that it'll all work out. At Fox, the picture was really clear that the faculty is here. Almost day or night, they give you their phone number. Whatever it is they're doing, they'll drop it, they'll answer the question and make sure that you feel supported. All of the faculty are involved in research and something that interests them, and they're trying to find ways to better treat all of the patients that we're seeing and what's gonna give the most benefit to the patient that we have right in front of us. Came from socioeconomically challenged family. My dad passed away while I was an undergrad and my mom has a couple health issues. I wanted to stay close in case anything happens. The only reason that I was able to attend college was that I got a very generous scholarship from the Ford Family Foundation. The fact that this gentleman who had never even met me had the foresight and the kindness to set aside this chunk of money to help students attend university, I think that's kind of what leads my desire to give back to populations that are typically underserved, aren't provided with the same opportunities that many are. When I was Searching for programs, I, I learned that the DPT program at Fox does an annual service trip out to Africa as an opportunity to um, provide service and care at a level that they don't normally receive throughout the year except for when we're there. While we're there, we're also helping to educate those providers so that way they can provide better care for their community even when we're gone, because that's what we're after. The major challenge to my faith was an undergrad not attending a Christian university. I kind of fell away from the Lord a little bit. I didn't spend as much time reading scripture, surrounding myself with people who, who loved the Lord. That was something that was hard for me and I didn't even notice it in the moment. So coming to Fox was actually such a blessing in that I was then once again surrounded with all these people who love the Lord and it's you know at the forefront of their mind and not kind of on the back burner. My faith has definitely been reignited in some aspects um, just by being in the DPT program here and being surrounded with so many classmates who take the time and, and love the Lord. One of the biggest pieces of advice that I could give anybody coming into George Fox's DPT program was just to, to have an open mind. The biggest fault that we could have is not being willing to change who we are for what we could become.